Comics Plus, what is going on? My name is Akasan. What's up, Super Crows? DC Sun. Uh, so we're see. we're gonna watch something called The Bullet Train. I'm sure Shinkansen in Japanese. Uh, yeah, I'm assuming. Like I don't know. All I know oh, is that it's an actual a, trailer. Yeah, for it's now. an actual movie with Brad Pitt. Yeah, I, I heard about it being um, cast and all that kind of stuff almost a year ago. Okay, maybe a year, year and a half ago. Because um, even looked at trying to uh, audition for it. But they wanted uh, Japanese talent for what they had open on well, this let's, side. Let's see what it's about. <clears throat> like Shinkansen. What you got for us? Sony is actually doing. Okay. Yeah. Just one second. Hey, that's Sound mix it. Who? Oh uh, yeah. Zazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazazaz
<laughs> Wait, is that? Uh, that's Shorty, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. That's the one. Oh, that's so funny. You sure you want to talk this out? No, secretly no. Okay. I give out, you know. All right. Exclusively in movie theaters. A poster on. Yeah. Yo, what? You got you yeah. on, the, on okay. the poster okay. like that, like she's actually for the airlines. Right. What did you say her name was? Shorty. That's what she looks like. So if you've seen, but it's not Shorty. Yeah, I that's know. Karen of uh, Fujihara. Yeah, I know. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. they have her looking like Shorty, who was in the Apple TV um, uh, uh, series that just came out. Like, um, hairstyle, everything. They okay. look like the same person. I guess it's for marketing. Okay. But either way. <clears throat> okay. Yeah. But and I like, actually, I, 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 like that, I like name. that Karen is in this because. Yeah, Karen. Is it Fujimoto? Or it might be Fuji. Fuji. Something Fujihara. like that. Yeah. So I'm glad that she's in it because. Um, That's The so last funny. thing that I got That's to see so her funny. in was boys. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's so funny, though. That's so funny. Yeah. Uh, you know what? Better. Okay, so they're calling it Nippon Speedline. Get on board. Uh, the That was a Shink. Was that the kanji for Shinkansen? Yeah. It's the, basically Shinkansen. Shinkansen? Okay. Yeah, yeah bullet train. So Because remember, Nippon being Japan, right? that's not even in the title up there. Right. So I guess they're calling it Nippon Speedline. No, well, I'm maybe just talking about the kanji. Nippon Speedline is the kanji, TV spot. Right, I'm just talking about the kanji yeah, for Shinkansen. the actual yeah, Shinkansen. Because yeah. I think it's funny because the train to Pusan, yeah. they call it uh, Pusan no Shinkansen or Shinkansen no Pusan or something like that. Um, Interesting the Korean version. So I, yeah. I was always wondering what the different ways people will translate yeah. bullet train or high speed rail train or whatever. So like even she, out here, she doesn't look like herself, man. this is so funny. It's, she, she looks like she'd be playing like the comic relief, the complete opposite of what we see her in as the, in the boys, which I'm going to like. What? Yeah. Which I think is a good thing, you know, like, and, and which, little, What's funny to Pin me? On the head is Fuji -san. What's funny to me is just the fact of how culturally, like, obviously, yes, she's Japanese, mm. but the way you know they do up her makeup and all that, it mm. just would re realistically would not be the way that. Uh, most, but not on the Shinkan. Not on the Shinkan. Not almost. Maybe. Maybe nightclubs. Probably. Probably, like, I would um, say it, makeup wise, um, more like uh, airline as opposed to the bullet train. You, you think so? I think I think the makeup is too heavy for Jow. airline. Still, you haven't been on Jow. I don't. Jow, I can't uh, afford Jow Jow and, Jow. Yeah, and yeah. Anna. Now they do they, they do it really heavy handed. Okay, well, not so much they do it heavy handed, but it's it's very, it's very clean. Okay, but it also right. could work here or okay. abroad. That makes sense. Kind of that makes sense. And that's what I see when I see her because. Yeah, you, she looks like a, look a, a them, cabinet attendant. She looks right? like a cabinet attendant. Now, or a Pokemon here, center trainer. Like but they don't, they don't really um, get done up like this. Like most right. of the time, their hair is if it's not pulled back, then it's just barely down to the shoulders. So what? Kind of thing. That's a good point too. Um, that's a very good point. So what we're referring to is the, just the fact that in uh, Japan, that uh, makeup, a uh, heavy makeup, is somewhat considered a bad thing, or um, it's not in overall in most industries. Just heavy makeup is uh, considered taboo. Yeah, they 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 keep it. You can't have dyed super, hair. Super yeah. simple, or yeah, um, it's usually like mute or natural colors only, with like right one shade of color that's different. Maybe lipstick, and even then, it depends on the company. Right, it's a very interesting thing. But uh, overall, the game, the the game, because it I, feels it like, a, like game. a game. It really does feel like a game. But now it makes a lot of sense that it's mm. from the director of Deadpool too. So yeah. you know, um, I, I'm sure some of the inaccuracies. I was going to ask you though, yeah. the interior design. Have you have you actually ever yeah, like? So have looks... you been on a Shinkansen that's ever been that colorful on the inside? Because uh, I have yeah, never. I've yes, only the taken Shinkansen general. Shinkansen going to Narita. Okay. Uh, I'm sorry, or Narita for. Um, anyways, the Shinkansen going towards uh, Narita has a similar uh, layout, but okay. it's not. It's not as colorful. Like this right. section like, here. Right. Like this is what I'm talking about. This section here, yes. Okay. All of that fits, and this side, uh, this right panel, recent more recently than before, because they're right. trying to update this. Right. Because right around the time during the Olympics, they were starting to redo things add color into them because yep. usually you're looking at white 
dark blue, a splash of red somewhere, yep. and then uh, like this, wood grain colors. That's it. Because I started noticing that during the Matrix, uh, mm. the fourth Matrix movie and things like that. I'm like, why are they making the Shinkansens on the inside so colorful? Right. Outside of like the special campaign Evangelion or yeah, Pokemon yeah, yeah. That's right, thing. You if know, it's not a tie-up, right. it's just very bland. It's really bland just and white plain. and green and that's it. So yeah. like, so I was really wondering if like I'm just not paying for the expensive ones. No, so <laughs> basically when, when you're, so for those that haven't written on the Shinkansen, when you're going say from front to back, the front, yeah. they have two or three sections throughout the train that are basically non-reserved. And the non-reserved look more like uh, the beginning of the trailer. Yeah, where he's sitting like that, and I do and then I, like this. I do appreciate the attention to detail and the fact that they actually have a quiet car because these yeah. do exist. There's about three or four cars yeah. where you literally will go in there and, and nobody like is making no noise. Talking. It's so weird. And if yeah. you make too much noise, the attendants will come yep. up and they'll tap you and ask you to be quiet. And then after that, if they have to come back, they'll move your seat. Yeah. So you get one warning. But basically, the seats look more like this. Yes. Where it's that standard table in between. Even if it's um, it's not a double uh, double seating, it's your seat and it's just one makeshift looking table. Then as you go through the back end of the Shinkansen, that's basically where your classes change, like business right. class, and the, or eventually first class kind of thing. It ends up like that. So the most colorful trains that I've been on, I would say. Dealing with the Olympics and before, um, going to Narita and then also going up into the mountains because those are closer to like overnight trains. Right. Yeah. That's about it. And <laughs> but this this doesn't exist. Like but there it, is so, there is no, a lake look, and all that look, stuff I'm underneath just saying, Fujisan, Look, I'm like, just saying guys, that uh, Yanagawa or y Yanagawa? No, uh, Yama Yama. No, 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 no. Ah. Yamanashi. Yamanashi? Yeah, Yamanashi. Yamanashi might have been developed. This might be an alternative world where Yamanashi started to get power and LEDs in there. It, 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 it looks like they were taking the Ghost of Tsushima and um, the Hollywood version of Fujisan and oh fused them together. It's, it's okay though, but the other, also the other thing that kind of threw me off a little bit was like what? The no, like you, like their, no, uh, like you were saying. What's interesting about this is like you were saying. So. This is almost a mix between an airline. It, and, yep. Yeah, because this section here. You're right. Um, the cart. It's not, it's not. The cart is is accurate. Somewhat, to, but to, it's kind of designed more like heavier. an airline, right? Yeah. Uh, no, no. The cart in the middle. Oh, the because, cart. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The cart in the middle is accurate. The, the ones on the side stuff are a little on the weird. Side, yeah. It's a little bit much. Like right. I'd say more so of the left side is accurate to where the right side has too much cabinet space and a bunch of other stuff. However, the, the however, pullouts on the bottom, right. they don't really use those um, unless you're on the older trains. One actually. of the one of the things to keep in mind, though, a lot of it is also, well, at least they got yin there, which is kind of good. Um, one of the things also to keep in mind is the fact that uh, they need a particular, a more wider angle for a wider shot sometimes. So mm. it, it makes sense, but it's yeah. just so funny. Well, there you guys go. Two, funny. two Japan nerds, or no, two Japan Entrepreneur uh, expertise here, uh, so, expats living out here, giving do you, your. Uh, do you think he was an assassin, a retired assassin? Yeah, I think so. Which is, uh, it's funny that it kind of has a Deadpool ish sort of feel. Like it he, does. He doesn't really take it so seriously, and he's kind of like joking the entire John, way. John Wick, if he, yeah, if he enjoyed his job. <laughs> <laughs> but you know, I'm I'm okay with that. You know, yeah. not everything needs to be like super, super heavy handed super. like yeah. that. Yeah, and know? I kind of like it because the last few things that we've seen Brad Pitt in have yeah. actually been quite serious. Yeah, yeah. So it's kind of nice to see him play a, a balance of the two. Now the real question that, and he's is fighting Craven. The real the real question is that is interesting though that because it's a Sony project. Yeah. The real question is will Brad Pitt come to Japan for the premiere to for the premiere and come to the Comics Plus Studio. After we just took a huge dump on the inaccuracies of that movie. <laughs> will he show up and will we have a collaboration? That's what I I'd like to almost know. almost guarantee no. Yeah, but we'll see. He may actually, you know, come over for the premiere in which he'll do an interview for Comics Plus. Come on now. You hooked me up. You hooked me up, Sony. With Well, I ripped it all out. You hooked me up. If you haven't seen the video yet, make sure you check it out. You hooked me up, Sony. Uh, yes. Aka Sun, Brad Pitt, DC Sun, 2023. Let's make it. Oh, actually, no, 2022. Yeah, Forget it. Well, Let's it do it now. Up, it comes Let's, up this year, com right? 
watch Here. it. Watch, no, watch the movie. It comes out on the seventh. Uh, I mean, uh, in July they said, watch this movie come out next year in Japan. <laughs> God, I hope not. That would be annoying. We'll talk to you on the next one, guys. Peace. Peace.